So as you guys can see on the ground here, man, you know, it's been raining heavy. How you doing? You got enough room? I want to check this out, man. Now he's going to make it through there. It's a tight space. I want to show you guys something, man. Uh, these guys take little room out here and make something out of it. Hell, all in the Philippines, man. All in the Philippines. That's our driver there. Decided to come on out for the, to the country for a little bit today. You know, it's a beautiful day. Well, I can't say it's a beautiful day out here. It's raining out here, man. I was thinking about taking a walk around out here and, um, in the village to show you guys where I'm at, but I think this is where I'm really going to stay. It's too rainy out here right now. You know, don't want to walk around out here, catch a cold out in the Philippines. I am going to be out here for a little bit longer, so I'm just going to chill and take it easy right where I'm at, man. Gotta make do with what you got, man. Gotta make do with what you got. God knows how many things that man can carry in that side part right there. But it is the Philippines, man. You make do with what you got. But anyway, let me walk back up here to the house, man. But what I want to say to you guys, man, is that, you know, the Philippines is an amazing country. There's so many different aspects about the Philippines that amaze me every time that I come on out here. You know, I always discover something really new every time I come out here to the Philippines. Oh, 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 oh watch your step, man. Whoa. She almost lost a step coming out here. It's very slippery, man. Concrete road. They got grooves in the road, as you can see. But, you know, you have these little green moss built up on the road. And, um, you know, people can slip in these things very easily, man. I remember my daughter last year was out in Bac Leon and she was walking up a little slight hill, a lot less steeper than this, and fell down and, you know, split one of her tooth, man. But, um, like I was saying, you know, I always discover something new every time I come to the Philippines, man. Nothing is really the same, you know. Nothing is really the same. You always tend to discover something new. Let me go ahead and take a ride up here. So I'm going, I'm going on up here. I'll tell you guys a little secret, man. My wife is not really good with direction. On the way up here from the city, she totally forgot <laughs> where we were supposed to be going, where her friend lived. I said, how can you forget? You know, where your friend live. You are from this town. You are from Bilal. You got to know, <laughs> you, you know, where your friend is. She said, you don't remember. I don't get it, man. My wife and direction is not really the best. But here's the kicker that really got me. And I'm going to show you guys here in a minute, man. You see the center right here? You see where this ambulance is right here? Her cousin, her cousin working here as a registered nurse, right at the center right here. And I said, babe, how can you forget, you know, where your friend lives? So in other words, you don't remember where, you, um, where your cousin works. She said, yes, I do. So I said, listen, your friend's house is directly behind where your cousin works. And let me show you something else real quick. It's really coming out, coming down out here. It's really raining. But I'm going to walk around and show you guys. Got to watch the road here, man. I got to take it easy. So I'm going to go down here a little bit further and show you guys how it is so easy to remember where her friend, her best friend that she went to school with, to college with, lives. And you're going to see in a minute. Because it's the only market in this barangay, the public market. And it's just right down here. So you guys are gonna, gonna actually see what I'm talking about. And it's just a quick walk around the block. You know, just down from the, um, the medical center. 
Hey, how you doing, Ma? How are you? I'm good. All right. So, this is the public market right here. I did a video on this place yes, I mean, last year. It wasn't done. They were still working on it. But this is the public market right here. And now I'm going to walk around over here. And I'm going to show you guys right where I was standing. So, I don't understand how someone can be from this area here and don't remember where her best friend live. I'm not making fun of my wife, man. I, you know, I'm just trying to make light of this video here. Just to let you guys know my wife. That's why every time we go somewhere, I always tell her when I'm driving, pay attention to a landmark because anything can really happen to me. And if something happened to me, you got to find your way back. Because, you know, we do take a lot of drives and we go a lot of places all over, you know, the southwestern United States, Arizona, California. And when I'm driving, she don't pay attention. So this is where I was just now. So you saw that quick walk, right? And my wife just did not remember, <laughs> you know, where her friend lived. Isn't that amazing? You know, I thought I was going to go another route with this video here. But I say, you know something? I'm just going to go ahead and just stick on um, talking about how some people are just challenged when it comes to remembering certain things. Very smart woman. Very intelligent woman. But when it comes to finding places and remembering um, landmarks and things of where she should go, she don't remember. But anyway, I'm going to get out the rain, man. I thought I'd share that quick video with you guys. I was going to go somewhere else with it. But, you know, once I start walking up this hill, I say, hey, man, let me just tell you guys this little story here, man. And you guys always know what it is with me, man. It is always peace and love, man. Peace and love. Let me get on back in this house here, man. It is raining out here. Peace on out. Peace on out.